Yes. Now, before we begin, you know, there's different um, search engines out there. There's Google, there's um, uh, AOL, there's so many out there, right? Right, yes. But the thing is, let's look at Google, okay? Well, what happens if we type in, let's just say, um, Montreal? Whoops. Yeah, um, yeah, okay, yeah. Oops, I don't know. I'm, I'm fat fingering all kinds tonight. Montreal. Well, what happens? See what happens when it comes up to Montreal? I bet you if you go real deep, it'll show you all kinds of stuff here. I see like, it right now. Yeah, yeah it, it, it talks about like uh, the weather, it talks about uh, Twitter. It practically even shows where I am located. It's like right. it keeps. It keeps a tab on all that. Like, you know, it's like looking at all your personal stuff and uh, so like... They know basically who you are, what you're doing, and uh, uh, probably uh, almost almost like what you're thinking with Google. Yeah. Google, Google wants is the mind. Google wants to connect everybody, wants to connect the whole world. They want to know everything you think of for money and for control controlling purposes. But I mean, if you even put your name in here, I won't do it. It's going to show you all from uh, Google Plus and uh, um, Facebook, perhaps YouTube. It's going to show all the stuff that you've been looking at. And it also, it's the ads are always around, you know. And I, I personally, I stay away from Google. I, I don't use Google. You know, it's, it's just too... Um, too personal. I mean, look, you even see my picture on here because no, uh, so 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 I, I'm sure that they, they 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 watch what websites you go to, everything that you do, who you talk to. It's it's all encompassing the big brother, the eye in the sky. Google, right in your home. That's the eye in the sky. You know that that, that and, and 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 the spooks, the CIA, they love this because they're saying, oh my God, people are actually giving the information on Facebook, on Google. This is the best spy program we've ever used. People are yeah. willingly giving you information, like on, on, you know, like where you are, what you're doing, especially on Facebook. So, uh, I'm doing this, I'm here, I'm, I'm on vacation, uh, I'm at this cafe, I'm at this restaurant, I'm driving, you know. So, uh, what, a, what a tool that, the, that, that, that Google has, has done, you know, uh, has invented the internet. But there are options. That's the beauty. That's why we're doing this. If you go yes. right here, there's start page. You look at this. I love start page, the world's most private search engine. And uh, when you go on it, after you're finished, it erases everything. Now, well, not, of... not really. You got to do it on your browser. It doesn't erase. You got to go into your history and erase the history. Well, but it I, doesn't I, I keep start page it. Only on my phone, the application. Oh, you could even use it on here like I normally do. You see, you type in Montreal, and it will take you like because it's powered by Google. Like if we go back. See, it's powered by Google. Exactly, but it, no. it says it switches up private. It says it, it. It even says it. I just saw it. Yeah, everything is private. They don't keep everything. Look, it looks mostly like Google, right? It's like very similar to Google. And and and, and your picture doesn't appear. No, no, it's like really, you know, it's personal. It's I love it. It's I mean. <laughs> Like in the old days of the internet in the 90s when you used to use a search engine you used to type in and that's it the information that came out came out and then you logged off that was it not like now where uh, on google if you look up anything remotely dangerous you're like oh my god am i gonna get in trouble am i gonna get this is this gonna happen what do they know so much it's it's, it's as if when you go on google now it's as if the whole world's viewing you and, and there's a spy they know everything you know it's not like the old days uh, of the internet back in 1998 and, and like, that's how it feels when I go on start page. It feels now, like the beauty about start page is it has its own proxy. You see that? Yeah. If you click yeah. on it, see what happens? It takes a bit longer because it's going, it's not going on your, your own network. It's using it's, the start page network proxy. Takes, so it's, it's like. Long. This is good if you have to look up sensitive information that what we do for our, our shows and to expose certain things. Yeah, you see, it does take longer because it's like going on the proxy. It's not going directly. And you see, it goes on here. Now, if the person on Wikipedia wants to say, hmm, who's looking me up? 
well, they'll say, hmm, start page, IX quick, which we'll be getting into very shortly. Yeah, this is like good if you want to do like CIA stuff, this and that, like look up the CIA or if you don't want to get caught. But you know, I'm defining the whole purpose. I know that I should be using Firefox or uh, Firefox is the best for that. Or even uh, Opera has a VPN address now where you could type it in and they'll. I have virtual private network. So, so that, that's it for Microsoft, that. Even the Edge has it, Microsoft Edge has it, uh, a, a VPN. With a click of a button on my Windows 10, with a click of a button, uh, it says it VPN right here, right here uh, on uh, the Action Center. I could click VPN, but I wouldn't use it because I don't trust Microsoft, obviously. All right. This is the next one, IX Quick. I personally have not used. So, Mario, you could talk about IX Quick. Well, if IX Quick, more or less, you see what it is here? It tells you what it found it under, what, what found. And it's Yandex, which is from Russia. And then you oh. have Gigablast. It's not using the Google. It's using those two search engines. Like, I mean, those two... Uh, so yeah, search engines under IX Quick. Now the thing I don't like about this is I've noticed that there's certain Russian things because Yandex is from Russia, and the search and the search isn't that good. Like no. I'm I'm not crazy about IX Quick. I mean it's okay, but you see, well, no proxy. Yeah, there, there is proxy. Oh yeah, right there. Yeah, yeah, there yeah, is. It still holds. It still houses the proxy. Well, you, you could. I rather use start page also. This is a good alternative to it. And you can make it, you see, add to Chrome, you could add it to Safari, you could add it to Firefox, Opera, all the major browsers. And you could the same thing goes with start page, duck duck go. Which we're going DuckDuckGo, into next. Which is next. Duck duck go. Now type in one to you. All right. Beautiful, wonderful Montreal. I don't know why I'm typing Montreal, you see. But there's no proxy to this. And this is kind of new here. Time. Strict. Yep. And, and what does this strict say? Okay, that's a safe. Okay, no adult content. Okay, that's good for if you have kids. Well, even for me or anybody, I mean, look, you don't want to stumble upon porn. So strict is good. And if you notice, if you use the browser Tor, apparently this is the main uh, search engine on Tor. The main what? The main search engine. Oh, yes. On Tor. What did I say? Did I say something else? No, no, because it, it cut off a bit. No, no, but the thing is, Tor is to go into the, into the deep web, the dark web. But that, that, that's a whole thing into itself, you know, uh, the deep web, the dark web. Uh, but, yeah, uh, who who powers uh, DuckDuckGo? Is it, is it Yahoo? Uh, no, it used to be. No, actually, that's a good question. It's no longer Yahoo. They're saying it's powered by Amazon, which I'm not crazy about, and it's based here in United. Well, here in the United States, close to United States. So, uh, from what I was told, that they can take all the information, but who and knows that, sell it or but who knows that, it? Who knows that? Who knew that Amazon has a search engine? Like when I go uh, when I go to Amazon, I, I type in the books. That's all, but. Maybe I should type in my name when I go to Amazon, see if something comes up. Because where is this search engine of Amazon? Very interesting. I don't know, but that, that's what I was told, that it's Amazon that, that was one of the, the ones that is used. Hmm, unless they just funded it. I don't know. You see what it says here? Yandex. In partner with Yandex. So it could be that they, I know they got rid of Yahoo. Okay. Because Yahoo had problems with it. So it could be that it's in partner with Yandex, which isn't bad, but you know that Yandex is Russian. I have yeah. nothing wrong against Russians. But, There's but, nothing wrong. But you see, the thing is, the problem with all of this is, don't think if you use, even if you use all these force, these force search engines, you're, you're, only, you're only in the surface web. And it's indexing just the surface web, a bit of it. It doesn't even go into the dark web or the deep web, which is 500,000. Uh, 500, sorry, 500 times bigger than the surface web. So, you know, but I guess, I guess us surfing the surface web is, is good enough. Yeah, I mean, for what we're going to be doing, 
or what we do on here it doesn't hurt but a little bit of privacy doesn't hurt also yeah, right? right so i mean i mean if we went in a deep web to look up stuff like like the dulcie base that'd be something different you know but uh if you uh, do yeah. do that then you go on to start page and you type it in on top here oops you see it takes me right to montreal hey look does this show where yeah you see it shows basically hmm. uh, but it doesn't show where, where you are no i don't think it shows where I exactly i live but you know i don't want to go very deep into there because it might show but then again that could just be in you know uh approximate montreal it's like in the center of montreal if you notice that yeah exactly Mont the circles in montreal could be just anywhere you know so the dolce base if you type it in you go in the proxy it'll take you through ix ix uh, ix quick and you're in there you know but i don't know how safe i mean not how safe but how private that is it should be private like i said you are using the proxy but my i my favorite one i've been using it for over two three years now is start page so i'm going to stick with start page i, I google i i google stuff uh on google then i want to duck duck go and have different information i'm like wow i never knew this i never saw this on google yeah and because was, google personalizes everything for you it's going to look at what you want yeah, but um, uh, yeah, but let's say I, I type in something. I, I want information, different information that I didn't find. I found it on. on I only found it on DuckDuckGo. I did not find it on uh, Google. Hmm. But now recently, I started to use Start Page when I have to do deep research into into the work that we do, because we don't always want the same information that comes out. Because Google uh, is just a certain information. No, no that, that's it. Yeah, yeah, exactly. exactly. But I guess that's it for, uh, for our take on this. Let us know what you think. Comment and subscribe and like this and video. Subscribe and even click on the little bell of our YouTube channel. Uh, you know about that, right, Mario? Yeah, I know about that. Well, you know, there's always changes. That's the thing with Google. You yeah. can never, uh, you know, you could never rely on them. I mean, they're always changing. No, That's what I mean. Always changing, changing without, without warnings. It, 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 it's come as you go, you know? One day it's like this, one day it's like that, the next day will be different, you know? So that's it for uh, this, this video, video, I suppose. Yeah. Hope you enjoyed mm -hmm. it. And, and uh, we'll be back soon with another video. So thanks, guys. Thanks for watching MNR, Mario, and myself. All right. Thank you. Have a good one. Bye.